and welcome everybody here in Twitch chats and everybody on YouTube who's watching this video later on for a special edition of the stream today. We have a sub battle Saturday. That's right, it's the last Saturday of the month. So we're doing sub battle Saturday. And because we hit enough sub goals recently, we're actually turning this into a 12 hour stream. So that's right, we're gonna have 12 hours of sub battles. If you're kind of new to the, the sub battle stream, don't haven't really seen this happen before, uh, what's going to happen is I'm going to be playing against my Twitch subscribers here each round, and so we're going to be playing best two out of three. Uh, we're going to be playing matches, which are going to be best two out of three, like normal. And as far as what deck I'm going to be playing, I have a wheel here with 44 of the decks that we've been playing on the channel uh, over the last few weeks. Um, so I'll be spinning this wheel each round to see what deck comes up and what deck I'm playing. So I'm going to be playing a different deck every round. Um, and then, of course, the viewers are going to be bringing their sweet decks every round. And so you get to see a lot of different cards and a lot of different games of Magic. And so it's, it's a lot of fun. All right. So for everybody here in chat, uh, for any subscribers here in chat, if you have not already, type the word battle uh, if you want to be the first person to play against me. We're going to be go ahead and see who's going to be up first here. Okay, I'll, I'll just keep this wheel over here. Hey, Wake, good morning. All right, last chance. Type the word battle into the chat if, you're, if you are a subscriber and you want to play. No, of course. No, you don't have to be a sub to watch. Anybody can watch, of course. You can be here. Um, of course, uh, for those of you in chat, usually te cheer on team chat. Um, it's usually like me versus versus the subscribers and and people in chatter are cheering on my opponents for today. <laughs> well, Debo, type if you want to be up, Debo, type battle. Last chance. Okay, let's see. Give him last chance. <laughs> okay, Steel's in the way. <laughs> All right, so the first person will be Ian Ray. All right, Ian. All right, send me that gamer tag. And this is my gamer tag right there. You can copy paste that. All right, and let's spin the wheel. Let's see what deck am I playing first? Azorius Skies. All right, Azorius Skies is going to be our first deck to play today. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at our deck. I'm not changing our the deck list um, for every single deck because then I'd have to like go back through like the couple of weeks and find every single deck, and it, it just takes too much time. But I'll show the deck every like at the beginning of each match. So this is our first deck here. So we are just playing aggro, trying to win in the air. And all right, there we go. Let's copy paste this. All right, Azorius Skies. There's that. Make sure challenge match, best of three. Um, oh, I should change my avatar to the Eternal Army. All right, here we go. Uh, let's see. Drag challenge. All right, first match. We got some morning magic here on the stream. We're currently five hours early from where I usually start streaming. So if you if you are not uh, so if you're a subscriber and you know you. You typed in battle, you know, you wanted to play and you weren't chosen because Ian was. Um, stick around. After this match, it'll be the same thing. You'll type battle again. You know, I'm going to redo the... I'm going to redo, like, the giveaway again. And, and I reset it every single... After every single match because, um, you know, maybe somebody is, is here, like, for, for this match, but they're not going to be here in, like, three matches. So uh, I redo it every round. All right, good luck, Ian. All 
Ooh, maybe a mirror match? I think I'm just gonna play the Phantom Supreme because he uses my mana well. The Phantom Supreme, of course, being the newest item at Taco Bell. Oh no. Oh wait, my creatures are all really big. But still good. <laughs> Hawkeye okay, can't just lay on the keyboard. This thing's a spirit? That is a spirit. Hey, new subscriber, Shadows Fall. Welcome to the channel. Oh my gosh, no, Hawkeye. <laughs> just laid on the keyboard. I can't type stuff. Okay, there we go. He moved. Um. Welcome. Thank you so much there, Shadows Fall. Our first sub of the day. He's just laying down right here. <laughs> so yeah, you can get in the next match here, Shadows Fall. The wild wasn't meant to be contained. All Ooh, things looks like we got and end band stuff. In nature. Band stuff's pretty fun. Wow, what a draw. Man, that looked mean. That looked mean. Yeah, first sub of the day. Get that morning sub. <clears throat> yeah, Hawkeye's getting comfy for this 12 hour stream. Alright, so against Bant Stuff. I don't know if I'd change anything against Bant Stuff. Safara isn't as good because their removal isn't really damage based. You know, like they'll have like Deputy Detention and Teferi and things like that. Like, Safara is not good at all against Teferi. So I could cut Safaras, or just trim a couple. Maybe trim a couple for a couple favorable wins. Let's do that. Hey Chris, no, I don't. I don't have like my modern collect. I don't have like a Magic Online collection or anything anymore. But we're gonna have Historic here pretty soon. I'm pretty excited about that. Ooh. Think we have to mulligan. Yeah. Alright, we'll get rid of an executioner. I don't know if it's if Arena's coming to Mac. I think I feel like there was some I like now that you bring that up, I feel like there was some kind of announcement that that they're working towards bringing arena to Mac. Yeah, actually now I feel like there, that was an announcement. I forgot about that. Um, so I guess my answer would be maybe. Okay, Devo says yes, they are bringing it to Mac. These Phantom Supremes have looked really good. That's right, Mac plus Epic Store. That's right. Right on schedule. 
That's more like it. Um. You just let me know if you're up for round two. No, I don't. <clears throat> yeah, I don't have my Mana Traders account anymore. I I canceled that since I just don't play Magic Online anymore. Um, I sold out. Are much more reliable. Sold out let of Magic me Online. Show you what was lost. But Historic is a format that's coming to Arena pretty soon that I'm excited about. As far as a non-rotating format goes. <laughs> but no, I don't really have any plans to, to play Magic Online or Arena. Or sorry, Magic Online or Modern. Alright, we'll get Safara in here. Hope they don't just have like a, another like little Teferi that bounces Safara. Hey, what's up, track team? Ooh, it's Arcbo. Okay. Awesome. Yeah. I guess the... Yeah, uh, somebody posted that here yesterday. So it was just the Arena Twitter account was just like, what cards do you want to see in Historic? Maybe cards like, like Dark Confidant or... Um, or Worm Coil Engine or Brainstorm. Yeah, you know, so they're just like saying cards that have been printed before, and they're just asking, "What do you want to see?" All right, going for the win here. We could get settled. That'd be bad. Unlikely though. Got a wolf, gain three life, fight, but the fight doesn't matter because it's Safara. GG's. Man, that Azorius Flyers deck can just be real mean. That can be real, real mean. GG's, Ian. Okay, if you, if you like to be the next subscriber to play. Oh, whoops. Sorry. Sorry, not. Sorry, Wake. I messed it up. There we go. Now, underneath there where it says giveaway started. Now, type the word battle underneath there. So, Ari, Samantha, type battle again underneath there. All right, we're going to let. We'll be spinning the wheel, letting the wheel decide. So that game two, my first hand had one land and second had zero. Oh, man. Yeah, that's right. You were on five cards, weren't you? Yeah, you're on a mold of five. Uh, that's rough. And then that, that aggro deck can just, can just be so brutal. There. Almost had the Tulsimer uh, ambusher combo up. Almost had that. All right, everybody in there? All right, let's see. Hey, where to be? Thanks for that Twitch Prime sub. If you want to be up next, where to be, type the word battle in the chat. Give, giving you just a few seconds here. Hurry up and type battle into the chat. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. All right, the winner is Pitt. All right, Pitt. Send me your gamer tag. Ooh, you're on it. Love it. There's mine. Um, all right, let's spin this wheel, see what deck I'm playing. Kalia and friends.
Okay, so Kali and friends. If you're unfamiliar with the deck, let's open it up so you can see it. We are a Mardu, Angel, Demon, and Dragon deck. All right, perfect. Now you're running with your son. Well, thanks for stopping by for, for subscribing and everything, too, while doing that. And yeah, have a good run. That's something that, like, I always feel... Like, running's, like, the kind of thing, it's like, uh, man, I don't want to go run. But, like, ever, after, like, literally every time I run, like, that day, the next day, I feel so much better. What's up, love? All right, so this is our Kalia and Friends deck list. Angels, demons, and dragons away. Okay, so, yeah, what we're doing today... Yeah, so you just got to wait. Shadows fall for the next... For the next round after this match um so there's that's like kind of like what's what's happening there but yeah we're we're playing against subscribers all day 12 hours and so if you're a subscriber you have the chance to battle me today so this is basically a six card hand with the embodiment of agonies not doing anything Definitely a six-card hand. <laughs> so Sacred Foundry. Is this Feather? Or is this Mardu? Naya. Could be Feather. You're on the elliptical now? Oh, I'm jealous. Oh, you used to run 10 miles a day, but you tore your ACL three times? Rough. How's the elliptical? Do you like... Like, would you recommend ellipticals over treadmills? Like, I have a treadmill, and it's, you know, it's fine running on a treadmill. Dang, that thing's big. A 6-4-2 drop? With Trample? We have Naya Guild Mages for him. That's pretty sweet. That's pretty sweet. Ugh, no black mana still. Oh, this is Rien. I have never seen Rien in play. I have never seen Rien in play. So your multicolor creatures get plus one, plus zero. If another multi creature you control dies, return it to its owner's hand at the beginning of the next end step? Oh, I should have read that part. Damn, that card is sweet. Yeah, my knees... Yeah, treadmills are harder than knees. You know, like... <clears throat> ellipticals. Yeah, my and my knees aren't, like, that great. Like, they're usually pretty sore anyway, because I'm just sitting down all day. And, like, this is not... Like, this is not good for the knees of just sitting down all day either. Yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, let's see. We want this Noxious Grasp. Uh, Decree Exiles Red Stuff. That sounds good. Dispark. So, get Ellipticals over Treadmills for anybody over 35. Okay. Well, I guess I need to get an Elliptical then. Instead of this Treadmill. York has treadmill stations. That's pretty cool. 
All right, what am I doing? I'm sideboarding. Let's see. Kind of feel like they're going over the top of Tithe Taker. Yeah, maybe I'll get an extra Clarion in here and cut these Tithe Takers. We'll try that. Could I have Blood Sun to keep the forums from doing anything? I don't think that's worth a, a slot though. I'm just going to get the one for one here because I want to play Kalia. I don't want my Kalia to get Clarioned. This thing enters untapped. My card's kind of underrated. Alright, so I can get one of these angels. I think Seraph. With the death touch. I guess Resplendent gains a lot of life. If Resplendent survives. Like if we you know we just need to draw another land, but then we could play Hellkite this next turn and then go embodiment plus resplendent. Well that's pretty sweet. I guess I'm just going to be exiling this. I need to stay alive. Dude, pit stack's pretty great. What's up, QQ? Wow, we got Clarion real hard. That's bad. That's real bad. <laughs> I can't even block. I have to get I have to get rid of this Rien first. The blocking just puts it back in in their hands. Swimming in cold water is the absolute best. Hey, Telstar. Ah. 
Man, their deck crushed me. These guild mages forums were amazing. GG's, Pit. Your deck was awesome. GG's. Looked really good. I had never seen that, that Rien in play, or really seen anybody use Guild Mages for him. So there you go, team chat on the board. <laughs> to be fair, I think I'd, I've never drawn as good as these two games. <laughs> yeah, it looked really good there. Hey, happy Saturday. I actually did not get pizza last night. I just had um, last, last night. I actually didn't. Because, you know, it was pretty late and I was tired. I, w I wanted to get to sleep uh, to... You know, I didn't really want to like do like the twenty minute drive out there for pizza and back, and then have like pizza, and then go to bed kind of thing. Um, all right, yeah, I should try that deck. Yeah, if Pitt sends me the the list, I'll try it. I'll try it out. Cause yeah, I'd, I've never played a a re end deck. All right, so let's let's get the next person up. All right, if you're a subscriber, you want to be the um, next person to play against me. Uh, type the word battle into the chat. Uh, I'll send you a link, Pit. Here you go. That's good against mono red ferocidon and vampires. I would say Esper is where you'd want to be there like esper control um you know you, you can tune an esper deck to be good against those get a lot of bunch of like othakayas and stuff like that tyrant scorns cast down cast down is a really valuable removal spell that kills like all the vampires besides vanguard and uh kills ferocidon Okay, looks like everybody's in there. Let's see who's up next. Fairmount. All right, Fairmount, type, send me that. Oh, you get enough, Hawkeye? Okay, cool. Type X Wage Point Gamer Tag for mine. Okay, let's let the wheel decide what deck am I playing up next. We're down to 42 decks left. Is it Wizards? All right, we got Is It Wizards here. Is it Wizards? Here we go. All right, if you're not familiar with Is it Wizards, we'll take a look at the deck here real quick. So we got two Kefnets, it looks like. We're a little bit bigger, got a couple of Agra Bolos. And, you know, we're trying to win with Adelies. All right, yeah, make sure to check. Choose best of three. All right, double checking, make sure I was on best of three. All right, good. <clears throat> oh, you're playing four Sky Knight Legionnaire. Wow. Oh, and you have four glass of the guild packed? Yeah, main deck is just Vivian and, and Ixalan's binding besides the lands. That are rotating out. And then you had Honor Guard. Cool little deck. I'll save it. Thanks, Pip. Yeah, I, I I mean I don't I don't know exactly track team, but I I think seventy two you're probably good. 
I think. I'm not sure, honestly. Um, a few... Like a week ago or so, they said like what level that you should probably be around, but I don't, I don't remember what that was. Hey, 619, good morning. Yeah, team chat did win one sub battle. Yeah, I was I was not on my game that day. All these afterlives. And team chat was on their game and they got me. I mean, Arcanist is like the best card to have in play, but I don't really want to attack into all these two ones. So I guess we're stormkinning it up. So I went with the Stormkin first, is because I was gonna try to bait out a removal spell with the Stormkin. Ooh, I definitely cannot let those things die now. Oh no, that's going to make this more difficult. Yeah, that's going to make this more difficult. Hey, Zedrain. Uh, this is tough. can't really let... Oh, they went Death Touch. They went the wrong one. They chose the wrong one. They meant Vigilance. So I can't really let the Seraph die. Can't really let any of these creatures die. Mm. 
All right, game number two. I got this cat hair on me now. There we go. That's better on my face. All right, what do I have? Ether Gust, not looking good. Trickster. Trickster looks pretty great. Get rid of the afterlife stuff. Melody. Very good. Coil. Flame Sweet could clear, clean up tokens. Hmm. Yeah, Melody could clean up, or uh, Flame Sweet could clean up tokens. So if I if I play the sixty five though. Arcanist didn't look too good. Maybe we'll just take out Arcanist and like a Reckless Rage. If I play Mu Yanling, make their creature lose flying, make the Seraph lose flying. I could try Mu Yanling here. Even like those other like two ones on the ground. Um, I haven't too much used Arcanist with a bunch of pump spells. I haven't done that too much. Like a bunch of pump spells. Try to cast bigger things. Right, we're going to need a third land. Okay, there's a third land. Um, I'm getting rid of one of these burn spells. Shock Strike or Wizard's Lightning. They're all pretty meh. Perfect. Good job, Mu Yanling. Yeah, this is a good good matchup for Mu Yanling. Um Do not challenge a raging river. Rude. Take your violence elsewhere. Oh, well, I guess we have another cup nap. The sky is my domain. Wow. That is really good. That was really good. <clears throat> hmm.
Yeah, working towards that Moo ultimate. Even though we know we're drawing a dead card. We're still doing just fine. Learn to live with the land and be rewarded. I think it's gonna be a long, long time. We'll be able to steal one of these ministrants next turn. We drew really well with, like, after they after they contempted Kefnet, talked to the Kefnet. We had like the two perfect draw steps, drawing our second Kefnet and drawing our one Entrancing Melody off of that. We had like two pretty perfect draws there. I mean, those, that'd be nice, but I, I need to cast Melody for five, or for three. I need to use all five of my mana here to steal this. Looks like we're going to a game three. Hey, Recovery, good morning. Good morning. And considering our island can already draw a card, this isn't even really that special. We've drawn really well. Game Kefnet. All right, game number three. Hey, Sloth is going really good. Yeah. Nothing, nothing too new or anything. You know, still streaming all the time, making tons of fun decks. I started a thing on a Thursdays that we call Throwback Thursday, that I I really love, where I build around rares and mythics that are rotating out they didn't see much standard play and we've made some really cool decks like this past thursday we built around fraying omnipotence and um precognition field and vance's blasting cannons well this is sad
Yeah, they went really well. Yeah. And and so that's what I've been doing for the you know, last few Thursdays. We've probably made about you know, maybe like 10, thir 10 or 13, something like that, uh, decks there. And it's it's been really fun. <clears throat> okay, we're still in it. Not out of it yet. Hey, meaty, good morning. So I'm playing the creatures first because I want to be able to chart a course and not discard a card. I just want to be able to draw two with chart a course, preferably. Uh, they let me attack first. No, I got, got to do that before I get to attack. Don't let the Charter Course deck attack. All right, there's Seraph with the scales. Hmm. That's true, just don't let the blue deck untap. That is a good rule. Oh, you can do the death touch later after I block. Don't have to do the death touch immediately. But I'll fight if I must. Do not challenge a raging river. I know I'm supposed to be keeping Adelise there, actually. I don't really know what I want, though. It's so, like, Kefnet's going to block Seraph here. I can shock the Enforcer. Yeah, maybe I just wanted to land. I mean, trick. I guess I really want Trickster, but it's a little late. Do I, I guess I just don't even shock that thing. And save shock for after Adelie's. We're gonna shock one of these one one tokens. It's kind of better to kill the one one tokens. Well, 
That other Kefnet's a waste. I can get rid of it with Augur. Or I can just try to course to get rid of it too. I'll get rid of it with Augur. Okay. That would be nice to have for the Seraph. The sky is my domain. Wow, that's a card. That's a card right there. Respect nature, and it will offer assistance. Ugh. A timid attack there. My victory was washed away. Here, trickster. Yeah, it could. Yeah, Yummy could have Alpha Strike to me. Uh, I would have gone down to one. Just been able to block one of these. But I wouldn't really have died here because we still would have had, like, having Mu Yanling. In play is pretty rough. But even, even just, like, the two attack Mu Yanling, then the other three attack me. Because, like, one's going to have to die. So even if they do that, still just one dies. But I take, I would have taken four damage. I could just be at three and they would be they would have been at the same spot. I think we got this one now though. Kefnet carrying it home. We'll see. They draw like a Seraph. <sighs> so much, so much lightning.
but not quite enough lightning. So they know the, the Kefnet can attack him for four. Oh, I guess they already knew about this Wizard's Lightning, too, from revealing it. Man. That was a really good game. Just good, good three games, really. All three games were, like, really interesting. I had some really good draws. GG's, Fairmount. GG's. Pretty cool little deck there. All right. Pulling ahead from team chat there. Two to one now. Let's see who's going to be the next subscriber to face me. Yeah, we did mold a five and, and miss a land drop. I think just on turn two, I think. But... So yeah, if you're a subscriber, you want to play next Time Thor Battle into the chat. Yeah, need a need a draw engine in that in the deck. In the afterlife deck. I don't know exactly what that would be. <laughs> Alright, got some people in here. And of course just you know, one match for everybody, so like if, if you already play once. Uh, don't enter again. All right, let's see. Who's up? Oh, Edith Swarm and Welsh Dragon entered right after I did that. Dang, sorry. Sorry. But Ari, all right. Ari, you're up. Uh, send me that gamer tag. Oh, you're building the deck right now. You want to be next? Okay. I'll redo this here. Debo 4. All right, Debo. Send me your gamer tag. There's my gamer tag. Make sure Debo, you in here? Okay, perfect. Debo's in here. And I'm playing Golgari Citadel. Okay, this is a deck I haven't looked at in a few weeks, maybe even a month. Let's see what it's looking like. We may need to change something with the deck. We may need to update it a little bit. Let's see what we got. Golgari Citadel. There it is. Hmm. All right, we have a couple Legion's Ends in the sideboard. It's probably fine. Looks good enough. Two Field of Ruin? That should probably be more these days. That's good enough, though. All right, here we go. Golgari Citadel. All right, Fairmount. Hey, good luck at your job interview. You're going to crush it. Be yourself. And just relax and, you know, just relax and be yourself. Good luck. Okay. We have a pretty good opener. Maybe we got a we got a mirror match. The explore mirror. The 
the explore mirror. Recolor. Well, I'm going to feel the ruin. Hey Matthew, yep, we started real early today doing our 12 hour stream. So creatures going to the graveyard are pro is probably good for my opponent. My Devo is probably playing Command the Dread Horde. All right, we got that land. And keeping the Wild Growth Walker, even though we don't have any more Explore things, but Citadel will find us Explore things. We're gonna need to gain life when we have Citadel. Looks like that Field of Ruin play has Paid off dividends. Oh, never mind. <clears throat> Thought about trophying the overgrown tomb here, to be honest. I think I want to do that. I guess I should technically wait for draw step to do that. I just don't want to command the dread horde. A little surprised by the fourth forest. I thought I thought Debo was gonna have three forests. Casualties of war. Bond of Flourishing is so good with Citadel. Oh gosh, I want to just place. I mean, obviously, Jade Light's really great, but so is Doom Whisperer. Did I play a land yet? I don't think I've played a land. No, I haven't. Hey, who day?
Man, our deck is mean. We have two trophies, two Field of Ruins, but maybe we need more of those. Ugh. I guess I put the Jade Light in my hand. I want that fine finality. Just go infinitely here. All right. <laughs> Citadel is so unfair at times. So unfair at times. Yeah, so they got the four basic forests. Definitely want command in this matchup. Um, do I want Vela Summer? Myself. Legion Zen's really good against Wild Growth Walker, of course. And this just like kill stuff. Let's kill stuff. These are pretty good. The thing is, we have too many good cards. We have too many cards that are like good in this matchup. Like that's 70. I'm fine with playing all of these. So I think we just can't have this much removal. So I think we're just going no Veil of Summer. Basically, just no the cards we just brought in. Noxious Grass was an upgrade over cast down. We'll, just, we'll play the Noxious Grasps. I gotta cut four more cards. I guess just the Bond of Flourishing. You know, that's a pretty decent card, but just because we have to cut something... Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you do have you do have a lot of games like where you don't really do that much with this deck, but games like that are pretty ridiculous. But yeah, you have games like this could be like where you just like sit with your like five and six mana cards in hand, and you can't play them because you're just sitting with two lands. Like if Debo has Legion's End, we're so dead. Legion's End on Wild Growth Walker. We so dead. We so dead. Oh, really? Carnival Row is just super gory? Uh, I'm not. Yeah, I'm not that interested in just a bunch of gore. Well, that's too bad. Man, I'm so jealous of... Ooh, there we go. I was going to say, of Debo hitting land drops. Please no Legion's End. Don't want to be dead. Carnival Rose, yeah, the new new fantasy TV show on Amazon Prime. From what some people are saying is is like what, like it was a book, of course, first, and it's like the inspiration for Throne of Eldraine. I believe that was a thing that somebody said. That's worked out perfectly. Great land.
Krasis. Grab about that card. That card's great. Um. So if that was a creature there with the branch walker, if it was not a land, if it was a creature, I would have basically any creature. I would have surveilled it to the graveyard and then cast find and return those two. Of course, if it wasn't a creature, so. I was kind of hold on to finality here. Looks like a negate on my opponent's side. Could be disdainful stroke also. Hmm. Well, I resolved. How this thing goes is up to you, pal. No one said every defeat is a new beginning. No one said every defeat is a new beginning? Didn't you just say that? Haven't you said that before? No, I don't I don't have any guys blessing in here. Ha. I've seen worse. Really? All right, so I, th I think if they had Command the Dread Horde, they would have played Command the Dread Horde. I think. Yeah, I'm thinking Legion's End, Path of Discovery. Yeah. I want to see this last card in hand. Which is a land, hopefully. Trophy. Trophy's annoying. Oh no. Let's get draw. That's a really good draw.
Wish I didn't use my Legion's End already. I don't need to feel the rune right now. Hey, Sonic Bob. Welcome back. Thanks for that resub. Oh, no. Last card is a removal spell like that. That's probably the downfall for me, then. Very patient. Very patient here. Really surprised they didn't trophy the other Wagroth Walker. I really don't mind them trophying the Citadel. I'll give them the Citadel the trophy. I do want that Vivian though. Because we have we have four Citadels in here, it's pretty easy to find another one. But I kind of need this wild growth walker. Yeah. If Debo just killed the wild growth walker before I played these branch walkers, we'd be in a lot more trouble. Hey, Dessel. Let's see if you're worthy. This is not. Let's we'll have Doom Whisper be able to find us. Another Citadel for next turn. Ah, I just got rid of that Contempt. Or, like, whenever I... Cast fine and got the two wild growth walkers back. The Debo just let me have the path of discovery. Uh, and I guess I may just like mill myself out here. Don't tap the Field of Ruin. Let's drink sleep. 
Oops, alone tonight after. All right, I got 21 life to play with. So three, six, eight, ten. I guess 15. I guess I just reset Vivian. Wait, why does it say zero? Why does it say zero? Oh, the six from... Oh, the six from Command the Dread Horde. Oh, I forgot about the just the paid six life. I was like, oh, that's just 15. We're at 21. Oh, the six from Command the Dread Horde. I forgot about... Oh. Yeah, I got to pay that six life. No, we died. A horrible death. <laughs> yeah, I missed that. Lesson learned. <laughs> Both teams tried hard to lose. Yeah, I didn't. <laughs> I knew it was going when you said you had 21 life. Debo is a, yeah, a subscriber here in the chat. That's what we're doing today. We're playing against subscribers all day. What's up, Eisen F? And <laughs> tried to stop me with caps and everything, and yeah, I just, I wasn't looking at the, the chat. Yeah, opponents pause the stream. They don't stream snipe. All right, Pitt. Have a good one. I'll see you later. That was fun. Fun match we had earlier. Want to destroy? I'd rather destroy a black source than a blue source. Do I just contempt land war elf? You know, like destroy a land, basically. So yeah, y'all y'all knew that I was gonna be doing that, and they just you all wanted to give Team Chat the edge there. Makes sense. <laughs> Alright, so made him only play a two-two crisis instead of a three-three, so that's good. Wild and come to me. So taking the overgrown tomb because we need a third black source for the citadel. Ah, not 
Not again! Gross. Casualties of war are so good. That's why I tried contempting a Lanor off. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be 2 2 now because of that mistake. That was so greedy grabbing that extra Vivian that I did not need to at all. We already had a Vivian in play. So greedy. I had that one locked up. Hey, Choco, thanks for continuing your gift sub. They already have that for six? So seven, eight. I've lost so much already. Draw, and I'll be back, just like before. Man, Hydro Crisis is so good. There you go, give an extra love Not to the chat. Dead yet. Nice. That's a cute little birdie. Cute little birdie out there. Here we go, though. Here we go. Citadel time. Never count out bullets to Citadel. Uh, sure. What do I want to do a trophy? If I trophy a 5-6, they get back, like, a casualties of war. Which, that's pretty bad for me. Never count out Bullis of Citadel. I don't think I cast that one. Let's just play this Field of Ruin. Don't have the mana to activate it though. Alright, and suddenly... Suddenly I'm back. Aw. Uh, I kind of wish they scryed to the top so I could shuffle it. Uh, decline. I think I have use for this other Bolus of Citadel now. Oh, it puts us down to three. Jeez. Three's kind of rough. Hmm. 
Down to four. I didn't get through he meet my newest friend. Uh, so I don't know if I should have grabbed that Vivian. On I don't know that that Vivian may have killed me. No attacks. I am really glad to see no attacks. Oh, I can't play that on that four. But I want to play that, so let's play this thing first. Because if they just win attacks, I would have had to like just kill the the cavalier. Play the land for free. Mm. I'll tick up first. No one knows the wilds like I do. Ugh. So let's see, they have three blockers. I mean I could I could go for the win right here with the you know with the bullet citadel activation. Um but they have like removal though. We may not get there. They have like a removal like if it's like two removal spells over there. We're also just like really safe. So I don't really have to do that either. Like, really, like, just don't, don't have, like, like, we're not, like, in any risk of dying. Yeah, they have, the Cavalier has reach, so I can't just, like, say attack with Doom Whisper and then sack 10. Yeah, Cavalier, yeah, Cavalier will be able to get back the, um, yeah, I couldn't let a Cavalier die. I think if Debo attacks with both of the Cavaliers that previous turn, I would have had to kill a Cavalier, and then they would have been able to draw the Casualties of War that would have killed Vivian and Citadel and Wild Growth Walker and Aland. But I guess I had the Field of Ruin, though, I guess. Oh, I, that doesn't really work either, because, yeah, the Field of Ruin it just makes them shuffle. Pretty great match, though. Pretty, pretty great match. Yeah, I just needed to do three damage. Um, so yeah, I could have tried to attack with everything. Okay, but it was risky against a couple of removal spells, because then a couple of removal spells plus like block three creatures, that's like, that's five creatures dying, then then do, can I let damage happen, and then sac do I still have ten permanents to sacrifice? I don't, I don't know, that was a little risky. Oh, yeah, definitely should add Citadel to your deck. Yeah, Citadel does ridiculous stuff. Ridiculous stuff. All right, let's get one more match in, and then I'll do um, and then I'll do a, a reset and everything on Arena. Let's get one more match in here. So if you are a subscriber and you'd like to be the next person to play against me, type the word battle into the chat right there after it says giveaway started there. Yeah, that game too. I didn't. I forgot about the six life that I had to pay for the. Uh, I was. I was like, all right, let's put me down to six. That's fine. But I forgot about the the six life that I was paying for Command the Dread Horde. Um. 
So yeah, I was at 21. I was like, all right, I'll pay the 15. We're good. And yeah, so I messed that up. Okay, is everybody in there? Ever, all the subscribers type the word battle that want to play next? Everybody in there? I want to make sure everybody gets, gets a chance to get in there. Oh, Ari, that's right. Oh, I was going to play against you next, Ari. That's right, because you won the, the previous one. Oh, I'm sorry, Ari. Yeah, okay. Never mind. Sorry, yeah. Yeah, Ari, you're next. Sorry. I, I forgot, I forgot. All right, well, send me the... All right, so we'll have to do... So for everybody else, wait, wait till after this match. Ari was up next. Send me the gamer tag. That isn't something that I do very often, so kind of making an exception of letting you, uh, you know, be next. That's that's not something I usually do. So that's why I forgot about it. This may be the first time I've ever let somebody do that. But yeah, send me your gamer tag. Um, oops, that's not. I don't need to put the deck list up. I need to put the wheel. All right, let's spin the wheel. See what deck I'm I'm playing here. What deck am I playing up next? Rakdos Aggro. All right, perfect. Thanks, Ari. Okay. So let's check out our Rakdos Aggro deck. Where is it at? I feel like I missed it. Rakdos Aggro. Oh, there it is. Alright, so we're playing like... Yeah, probably a pretty, pretty cool little deck here. Got a bunch of one drops, some Dreadhorde Butchers, Rotting Regisaur, some Burn Spells. This is a sweet one. It's like mono red with good creatures. Or mono black with good removal spells. And card advantage. Put them together. You get Rakdos. All right, make sure you change it to best of three. So it should say challenge match, then best of three, then coin flip for the three options. <laughs> yeah, it is kind of weird. The red's the card advantage color. That is pretty weird. Yeah, Frenzy. Frenzy works perfectly with Rotting Regisaur. Those two work really well together. So challenge match, best of three, coin flip. Challenge match, best of three, coin flip. Could be Balderon from Poland. Maybe that's what the PL is, is for Poland. Here we go. 
Yeah, my, my arena needs a reset, so we're playing this one one match. Um, and then... I will start recording for part two of our the sub-battle stream. Alright, regret not putting back Basic Mountain to drawing a land immediately. Ooh, is this Golgari Citadel? No, it's not. 2 3 with lifelink. I can't get through that. I can't get through that. Hey, Mr. Smooth. Welcome to the channel. Thanks for the support there. Power surges through these lands. Behold, so number five on the day. Turn three, Nissa, on the play. Turns out it's still good. Turns out that's still good. Well, I'm really dead. Be wary of the ground you walk on. All right, well, I'm taking out all the gutter bones. Back to the shadows for now. No mid, I don't do that anymore. Oh, I don't know. Michael, maybe. So I want to start frenzying. I guess I play these things. I mean, they're just one ones. They're not doing anything against three three tokens. I'm gonna trade one for the Vraska to get Vraska out of here. So many planeswalkers. <laughs> Good help is easy to find in war. Hey, JRC. Yeah, early morning stream. We've been on for two hours now. So two of the 12-hour stream already finished. I 
I don't really know. Let's see. Let's see what we have in the the sideboard. How are we going to beat Nissa? Got some noxious grasps. All right, so all these gutter bones are out of here. Don't really love Dreadhorde Butcher either. <laughs> yeah, we so we do these sub battle streams each month, the last Saturday of the month. Maybe we shock it in with this thing anyway. I'll just do it right now so that if we draw a red spell, we can double spell with red spells this next turn. Like that. Go, Dino, go. I got some big dinos in here. I honestly don't mind that trade with the knife of the Paradise Druid because it slows them down and everything. I just don't mind that trade. So they're playing Ritual of Soot with a bunch of mana creatures. I wasn't really expecting turn 2 mana creature, turn 3 mana creature, turn 4 Ritual of Soot. But it got me pretty good. Got me really good. Through this land, we are all connected. I just can't kill Nessa. Rise, my elemental friend. just turns all of these lands into creatures. Very hard to beat. So they have infinite chump blockers. I need to be able to do the extra four points upstairs. 
I can't rely on the knight to do anything. Man, Ritual of Sit in your Nissa deck? Masker Girl in the Nissa deck? Those are like the best cards against Nissa. Yeah. Your demise won't be hey, soul farmer. Oh quiet. The land fights for us. Oh, I won't forgive this. Alright, we're gonna need to hit burn spells. Everyone is expendable except me. The land shall come. We are dead next turn. Man, this is so good. All right, so we get one more turn. Its pain is our game. Or not. Strange and magnificent world. Be wary of the ground to walk on. Alright, three and two. GG's there, Ari. Okay. So that's gonna be part one of our sub battle Saturday stream. If you're watching this later on YouTube. Uh you know, three to two, so real close ball game right now. Make sure you click on over to part two and continue watching to see some more awesome decks. All right. Um, yeah. See you there in a minute.